look on the screen. How about that I have to ask you? Two beauty queens, intelligence looking right at you. Look on the screen, look on the screen, look on the screen. Two beauty queens, success is in the jeans. Wow, this is awesome. So, what they were talking about. Pythagorean theorem. Let's go ahead and talk about that. See, what it is, is it's this right here. So, it's this. And uh, let's see, because <laughs> I really don't know about it. You see, Pythagorean theorem, the well-known geometric theorem that the sum of the squares on the legs of the right triangle is equal to the square of the hypotenuse, the side opposite the right triangle, or in familiar algebraic notation, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. So, y'all got it? It's this. And I guess this is the hypotenuse and got some letters on here and a triangle. And some more of that is over here. And here's some kind of formula with the ABC. And uh, I still don't understand it. <laughs> so, okay. So, listen, I'm not the mathematician. I know how to look at numbers on the screen for stock trading, and I know how to count some money. Other than that, who the hypotenuse is, where it came from, its origin, the Pythagorean theorem. All I can tell you is this right here, which is kind of confusing to me. It's all of this. Moving on. This is not a math class because I don't think I would pass. But, yo, the queens on the screen got it. The queens on the screen got it. A 2,000-year-old math problem solved. So they say they went to present this and they were the only two high schoolers in the room. Say what? The only two high school students in the room. These girls right here on the screen. They had a slogan that says, the school slogan, no excellence without hard labor. No excellence, the school slogan, without hard labor. And did you notice how happy the girls seem all in their excellence? Did you? I mean, we know that to me, they're like a genius. Come, are you kidding? They went to present this. And they were the only two high schoolers in the room. What does that tell you? Genius. The teachers are pushing them. Again, the school slogan is no excellence without hard labor. Hey, I think maybe maybe some of these families need a slogan. Expect the impossible. Seriously, maybe some families, even individuals, all need a slogan. Excellence is the expectation. People are what? People are doing what they want to do. How these young girls on this screen are structured. How they are structured in this school. Intelligent. Smarter than me. Because if, if I, seriously, Pythagorean theorem. If someone would ask me to show what it is, honey, I can't tell you. I might be like, what did you say her name was? Path of who, girl? Is Patty, what street does Patty live on? Oh, it's a math equation. Mathematical. Oh, that's what you. Oh, I don't be doing that. <laughs> no, I don't know what it is. Just to be honest, I was like, okay. So that's why I said, I read the little statement. It still has not synced in. But if you want to know what it is, here it is right here. Whatever this is, here's a triangle with some letters on it, some other information, the hypotenuse, and over here too. So if you want to know what it is, is this on the screen? That's the best I can tell you. But these a two thousand year old math equation, and they said, and you see here on the thing, has been proven. 
The only two high schoolers in the room that must tell me that everybody else was an adult. See what can be achieved. I'm, I'm assuming these girls have structure in the home. I doubt they're going to be going out and mom and dad or whoever it is, mom, the, the parents don't know where they're going. I can guarantee you they're not carrying the seat of poverty. And need. Listen, these girls, they take part in themselves or family, their culture, I'm sure. That's what I perceive. Very positive, very happy, very respectful. Starts in the home. Be it mom or dad, or just mom, women, or just dad. Grandma, me, my papa. It starts in the home. Self-discipline. How they carry themselves. They don't have those uniforms on because these are the hottest outfits popping. These are your leaders. We need to have more young women like this. As a matter of fact, I hope you share this with your daughters. Maybe they're not into math, but we need to show more positive images because Cardi ain't it. And beautiful as she may be, Megan ain't it. I understand they're entertainers. I, I just wouldn't have that as, as for my daughter. That If I had a daughter, that's just not acceptable. We're not going to have no uh, butt cheeks hanging out, post of kids to do that. I just, no. And maybe they like the music. That's, that's for you to decide. But we have to have some balance. Got to have some kind of balance. And this right here, this is it. Oh, they're going to be a success talk. I can already tell you right now. One thing they're not going to be more than likely is sitting up, baby mama with some dusting, four or five kids, trying to taste down the EBT and my chick. I, would, I find that that's, I don't see that happening here. Why structure, boundaries, expectations in this family, trust and believe it's already been set. Oh, yeah. It, boundaries been set. Been set. Again, the school, no excellence without hard labor. You can't do that if you're streaming all day, watching TV. Just on YouTube or TikTok, playing games up and down the street. The, the eight-year-old young black man. 18. $1.6 million in scholarship money. Accepted to over 40 universities. Gee, I'm going to put the video up next. It's taught in the home. If these youngsters can apply themselves to achieve great things, what does this tell you about the adults and the other kids that are doing the opposite? People are doing what they want to do. Yeah, people are doing exactly what they want to do. As I'm standing here right now, about to go, I'm doing this video. I'm also, as I've been doing all day, trading, watching the market. Yesterday was a hell of a day. Today, not bad. You know, I wasn't knocking down no oh, I eight to ten, eleven thousand dollars. Not today I didn't. No. But I'm not gonna complain. I'm looking at huh, maybe three or four today. But hey, I'm not gonna complain. I, you know, I've had better days, but it's cool. Hell, I have had a day but I'm worse. But what is it? I'm doing what I wanna do. On this screen, they're doing what they wanna do, what they've been taught to do. Behavior is learned. And they're going to go on to achieve great things. Uh, per the report, it says one is going to, they're going to pursue environmental engineering. Ooh, girl, look, I'm still on the hypotenuse. Okay. Environmental engineering and the other, biochemistry. Wow. Excellence, it can be achieved. But we have to have discipline. It starts in the home. So I just want to share this. I think it is awesome. Again, what? The only two high schoolers in the room. Look on Twitter. I've seen so many young black people. Oh, I got accepted to med school. I went over here. I went over here. Achieving so much. And I saved those because 
I want to go ahead and try to post those again this weekend. Why? People are doing what they want to do. Yesterday was salads. Today, I'm going to be eating like so bad. Like, R to my husband. No, it's pizza and hot wings and wine. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no salads today. That was yesterday. That's what I want. I heard about this little place. Somebody told me about it. I said, I'm going to go and check it out. So check it out. I have to order the food to see if it's good. Then I can get the report. I mean, you know, I want to make sure that they're making the food right. So in case my friend tells me about it, I can let them know, listen, I had the pizza and hot wings and, you know, either it was good or just wasn't. So I have to go and buy it. I, I just can't look at it. I need to go and actually look at it, buy it, and then bring it home and taste. And then I can, you know, give my assessment. Make sure to make everything right. So people doing what they want to do. I hope you do what you want to do and be happy, successful. I hope it's all positive. But this right here, this is what can be achieved. And when you have people that you love your children, you're going to want the best for them. Especially, I mean, seriously, you're going to want the best for them. So this one to share it, I think it's like hashtag awesome sauce. Hashtag these little ladies, yo, <laughs> this is boss. So anyway, let me know what you think. Feel free to comment, like, subscribe, and share. And again, the, um... Pythagorean theorem. I'm not even saying it right. So if, if somebody wants to know what it is, don't look to me in the comment section. I can't help you. Uh, what it is, is this right here. So whatever this is, whatever this is, th that's that's what it is. I am old enough to be their moms. Again, whatever, it, any questions, <laughs> don't look at me. Unless these young girls can tell you I can't, but it's this right here on the screen. You can Google it and do the rest yourself. Anyway, thanks for watching. Simply said on YouTube. Love you guys lots and please stay careful. And hey, don't be afraid to do what? Live your dream.